everyone. Yeah, I'm behind again. Sad, isn't it? <laughs> this is a review for the Bad Girls Club Mexico, uh, episode 5. Now, thank God Erica is gone. I thought, I really thought I was going to love Erica. And then she turned into a cunt. Sorry about my language, but yeah, that's pretty much what it is. And finally, Ashley decides that she's going to step up her game a little bit. Let's see what happens with that, right? Fallon is like totally on the wrong side. Yeah, after a while she finally understood that Megan and uh, Julie's idea of not liking somebody for petty fucking reasons and just going on and on and on with it without stopping, that it's done and dealt with, it's getting old. And then we get a newbie, Andrea, is that her name? Uh, I will somewhat agree with the other girls that, yeah, the picture they put up of her was a little hoochie. At least that's what hoochie is like down here. But beyond the picture, what she actually was during her entrance, she was actually the cutest thing in the world. She wasn't hoochie, she wasn't ghetto, she wasn't loud, and she was very, very polite, unlike other newbies who entered the house in previous seasons. So I'll give her that, and I think I'm gonna like her too, but you never know. And then let's get on to the fight with Christina and Ashley and Andrea. Uh... They left you alone to go smoke a cigarette and do whatever, and she fucking flips out. Uh, I don't understand that. I mean, the lights were on. I mean, I'm scared of the dark, too. I don't like sleeping alone, but uh, if I have a light on, I'm usually okay. <laughs> but that's unstable. Yeah, um... And, uh, Ashley's like a little fucking Pomeranian fighting back with her and everything, I mean... It's so cute, but at the same time, you don't want to push her because Pomeranians are usually very delicate. <laughs> That's a hazard in the house. If she's going to flip out just because she was left alone and then start throwing punches and pretty much throwing a fucking fit over nothing. R literally over nothing. I mean, that's not even spilt milk. Not even close to even, not even close to broken glass. That was like your cup left a ring on the table. Yeah, that's what it was like to me. It's not the end of the world. Next episode... Rima and Christina get into a fight, and yeah, I understand, like, I loved Christina, but again, that there was just wrong, <laughs> she needs to go home and go to a doctor about that, because that's, that's too much, <laughs> but until then, again, I know I'm sorry, I've been so behind, but a lot's been going on, and my next video, you're gonna find out why.